Oh, who did this? Well, la de frickin' da! Oh my god, in one of my recent videos I talked about how this is one of my favorite sauces and I was running low. Why is there never a note? Anonymous donor of Lottie's, thank you. Thank you so much. How can we get back on the right track? Today's vlog is made possible by Andy who sent me a pound of world-class jumbo Key West pink shrimp. monsters. <laughs> Voila. I appreciate the fact that when you eat shellfish, when you're sitting there chewing it, you know you earned it. You prepared it yourself. You did that. A lot of work for not a lot of food. <laughs> but so good. Deshelled, deveined, looking fresh. What a carcass. <laughs> Go ahead and toss those in with the garlic, the lemon, the salt, the pepper, the red pepper flakes. Marinate 20 minutes. The hardest part is waiting. And yes, I realize you can see my phone, AKA the camera in the fridge. We're not all perfect. I'm sorry I'm not the most boring person ever. Middle rack. Good. 400. Next to the other half of the chopped garlic that you reserve, let's slice this lemon in half and then make wedges for when we serve it. Rough chop some parsley. I mean, it's terrific, right? <laughs> Turn this to medium. Four tablespoons of butter. Add in the rest of our garlic. Some of that lemon juice from the rest of the lemons. A little bit more salt. One last little stir here, get it combined, and then we're gonna take it off the heat. Let it cool. Perfect timing. Let's get our marinated shrimp. Oh my God, it looks so good. Let's go ahead and scrape this, flip it on. All that shrampies. Get everything out of this pan. Combine it all. Those are so coated. Throw this beauty right in here. Eight to 10 minutes, do nine. Wow, look at that. Uh, you've got that iconic shrimp glow that everyone's talking about. And by movie magic, there we go, get in there. You see that? Get on in there. Oh my God. Little parsley. I made rice to put these on, but we gotta try one kind of as is. It's just looking so beautiful and steamy and perfect. Andy, I love you. I'm so excited, it smells so good. Cheers. Ho, 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 it's magic. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Do a twirl. What? Not overcooked at all. They have the snap on the outside. Come here. Now, how do I get more of these shrimps? That is so good. This is perfect. Look at that garlicky, buttery, lemony, seasoned shrampy. You just, you cooked it so well. They're so good. We're gonna finish all the shrimp before the rice is done. <laughs> and we're just gonna have a bowl of rice. Now let's put it together. The white rice with the garlic salt in the bowl. The rest of our shrimp. We're getting every single drop of garlicky, salty, lemony, you know what I put in it. A little bit more parsley for the green, just a 
touch more lemon, hit some of the rice, get on top of the shrimp, just a touch more salt to bring it all together. It might be one of the top five recipes you've ever made. <coughs> Damn. Everything you did was perfect. But... Do we still have ranch? No. <laughs> Andy, we're here. Let's get some of that rice. Get a whole shrimpy. Any and all shrimp you want to send us, by the way, <laughs> we'll eat. All right, here we go. First bite. All of it together. I swear to God, that's the song that I hear in my head whenever I take a bite that good. Like, even if I'm at a restaurant with a bunch of people, like if I take a bite in my head, oh, oh, it's, it's mad. <laughs> Such a doof. The flavors are just out of this world. If you love garlic and lemon and parsley and some of the best shrimp I've ever, I've never cooked shrimp better than this in my apartment, that's for sure. Some restaurants don't even do it this well. <laughs> I'm very proud of this one. I mean, I started this, I'm really, I was not much of a cook or chef. Like. I was just, I did very basic recipes and doing this vlog has helped me like, this isn't super complex or anything, but I would have no, no way would I have done this personally other than this vlog and Andy just on a weekday like this. Like that's what I'm trying to get across to you. It's hard to go back to having shrimp that doesn't have that good like snap to it. Overcooked shrimp is the worst. We truly got something special on our hands here. This recipe I followed, the kitchen, I'll link it below. I changed a thing or two, not a ton. Do it their way or do it this way. You're gonna love it. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. I don't know what else I can say to you guys. It just smacks. It's easy and it smacks. This would work too with store-bought Walmart shrimp, I'm sure. Wouldn't be as good, but it'll work. I'd love to turn this into like a street taco recipe at some point too, with some like corn tortillas, some slaw or something. All right, I'm gonna go watch TV with my wife. Get out of here. I worked all day today and I was like, I'm just gonna like throw the camera on and cook this meal. I didn't really plan to make a video out of this and this is what came of it. This was me not trying. <laughs> so I hope you appreciate. And on that note, the Venmo, the PayPal, the Cash App, if you wanna support the vlog. Here is also the address. If you wanna send me anything, you can. Always goes such a long way. I love unboxing like you saw at the beginning of this episode. And then as always, the Rory Boyle Fan Club, five bucks a month. We're getting new people. I love that. Thank you. Welcome aboard the board of directors. You matter now. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. Thank you for being here. I'm just gonna call this the Garlic XL Prawn Surprise. <laughs> What's a good name for this? What's a name for this? I guess I should go by the recipe. It'd be kind of a jerk move. Is it just called? Garlic Butter Baked Shrimp. Garlic Butter Baked Shrimp Up. Garlic Butter Baked Shrimp Down. It will be, I can promise you that in front of that TV. Hey, why don't we be good to each other, huh? That I drank too much and I talk too less And when I check my phone, so I sent those texts And now I'm in my head, filling with regret And when I read what I said, no, I won't forget I told them, text me back so I don't lose track Of all the conversations that we ate Do you have any extra shrimp to spare? I ate all of mine. I could like lift this bowl. You're already done? Yeah, I didn't film an episode. All right, well, guess it's just me. Bye again. Dad, I wish you could just shut your big yapper!